to put this part in before I start really cleaning my bathroom but on the sink on the side if you can see all of this needs to be caulked so I'm going to go ahead and use some caulking and get started okay I already cut the tip of this it's open I had to figure out how to do this I think I got it Okay, I think that's it. Okay, I figured it out. So I had to squeeze most of this in from the back. It's dripping, so I'm gonna hurry up and get this started. I just got some toilet paper. I was gonna use a rag, but I went ahead and got this. I got this at Dollar Tree. Oh, well, it's a putty knife. And then I got a oh, putty spatula. Yeah. And then I just got a regular sponge, but I'm gonna go ahead and get this started. And then here in the bathroom Thursday. All right, see you guys later. Okay, I wanted to go ahead and show you guys what I was doing in my kitchen. It's really not an organized with me yet, but um, these, remember these, we got this for Christmas and since they're not being used right now, you can always get more. I just went ahead and put my sponges inside this one. So I thought both of them that I have would be able to fit in this drawer. This is where I keep my hand towels and I'm gonna start storing my aluminum foil and my sandwich bags and stuff like that in this drawer, but only one could fit. I tried this side, it's still too big because of these little flaps right here. But I thought that was a pretty good idea. So if you have any of these laying around or any, you know, um, inexpensive plastic containers, if you want to put your sponges and stuff in, cleaning sponges, that'd be a good idea. The other one I'm going to use, I cut um, the sponges in half and I got some small pieces inside, but I'm going to use those for my cleaning rags. So that's a perfect idea. I think that's really neat. All right, and then in the other drawer, this is my junk drawer. And what I'm gonna do now is go ahead and clean that out and then show you guys the results of this. So, And here is the final look at the second drawer. Try to make it look more presentable, easier to grab things that I'm looking for. I took a lot out. And then here, like I said, is my extra sponges and my cleaning rags. There we go. Usually I just don't put this in my video, but I just want to show you guys a little quick way of how I get ready before I start doing my videos. Um, I usually don't wear makeup. This really isn't makeup, it's just eyeliner, but I put that on. I haven't worn makeup since I was in my younger years, early teenage years, used to be full face. Now, just on special occasions or when I feel like it, I just put eyeliner on my eyebrows. Yes, I do those myself, but yeah. And also, I'm a 90s baby, just to let you know. Before I get started with the bathroom and hole, I wanna go ahead and start with the sink. And I got some of these angled bristle charcoal anthracite toothbrushes they're charcoal infused and i'm gonna just take one put this back in my cabinet but i'm gonna just take one to use to clean the inside of the faucet where the water comes out of so i'm gonna use vinegar and get started and i'll show you guys the results after i'm completely finished okay you guys we're gonna start over here this is in my window. I have to get a curtain for this. But I got these three containers. This is just my hair accessories. I got our brushes, our hair brushes. 
And then I went ahead and store the toilet paper in this one. Up at the top, I just put some cotton balls and that brown basket, I've had it, so I just went ahead and put it on top there. And the shelves, I moved one cabinet. I moved a little bit of things around. It's the same up there, but I did add some more storage bins in here. These got our toothbrushes, our toothpaste, our toothpicks, deodorants, and this is my makeup, all my makeup that I have. And I just left those um, hand towels. They was for my other curtain, but I just love that style. So I just kept that in here. And with the tea light candle holder, I couldn't find anything else. So I just clipped one of my flowers that I bought from Dollar General and put there. Over here, I got some of my body mist. So I added this basket on the sink with some air fresheners. And that is the toothbrush holder that goes with that set. And then over here, I just put everything just like that. There's the curtain. My bathroom is not as big, so it's kind of hard. And these two pictures I got from Dollar General. It says, enjoy every moment. It has that peachy color in the mint. And this one says, it is well with my soul. I really love that one. So let me step out and show you guys the rugs I did get from Dollar General, but that was about last year. So that is it. I'm gonna turn the light off. Not too much, but just enough to freshen the bathroom up a little bit. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. If you're new here, please consider subscribing to my channel. It helps it grow and continue to thrive like it has been. I want to say I appreciate each and every one of my subscribers, my supporters. Thank you guys for watching and tuning in and showing me love and commenting. I really appreciate it so much. If you wanna watch more content like this, here is a list of my playlist right here. That'll be right here. So go check these videos out. Just really good things for you guys to watch and enjoy. Thank you guys. Have a good night. Bye.